Hi, this is Bo. I'm a singer-songwriter from the Netherlands. Um, today I'll be speaking about some piece of equipment I've got with me. I've had with me for a very long time. It's a Korg Pitchhawk G. Um, it's a nice little compact uh, tuner. I've taken it everywhere basically and um, apart from having to uh, replace the battery I think once every uh, every year maybe and uh, maybe a little bit more often but um, I don't really keep a lot of track of it. I think yearly maybe that's a good uh, estimation um, what I like about this one is um, it's very light it's simple you just click it on your uh, guitar neck I'm a left-handed player by the way I play upside down but that's my own problem um, I would not advise you to learn it that way um, on the left side uh, you switch it on so it's very easy and of course the goal would be to have the uh, tuner right in the middle uh, at the little arrow there then uh, it's perfectly tuned um, you've got some other uh, features there because it also has the mode button and with the mode button you can just uh, switch between uh, guitar bass and uh, just uh, chromatic mode um, this year I was playing with um, with a violin uh, quartet and uh, they were not tuned in 440 but they were tuned a little bit higher uh, so with this feature you can actually switch it to uh, 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 to 442 443 until 445 and then it switches back to 436 so um, I'll always have it on uh, 440 normally uh, which is the uh, standard of course and then the last button uh, I think for me it's kind of handy because uh, I always uh, tune my uh, guitar in a, in a flat tuning um, because it makes the guitar a little bit more light to play and um, for my vocal range, you can... Tommy used to work on the docks. Uh, we are sometimes doing very lo long shows and then it kind of helps to not have, have to reach uh, half a note higher uh, the whole gig. Um, so I always tune uh, flats and uh, this tuner has an uh, option. Uh, which uh, gives you the ability to tune it on uh, flat one or even lower. Um, that means you are actually uh, tuning not in E, but in E flat, which you're hearing right now. Um, to speak about a little downside also, uh, when I'm playing outside and there's a lot of sun, then uh, it can sometimes be a little bit hard to see the display. Then what I normally do is just go to a tree or a little piece of uh, shade and then uh, you'll be, be fine and you can tune it. Uh, the other um, possible problem is uh, when, you are, uh, when you are in a festival and the, the music, especially bass, it's really loud then it can be um, then it can confuse the uh, tuner so for very big gigs um, I would maybe choose for a different kind of uh, a tuner but for most of the most of the acoustic gigs I do I, I play with a with the acoustic duo mostly um, you'll be totally fine with this this tuner um, I haven't checked the recent prices because I bought it quite a long time ago but um, I think it's not that expensive and it's worth the money so good luck with this tuner and thanks a lot for watching bye bye